In today's video tutorial, I will show you how to make beautiful project with spider webs in Irish lace technique. For this work, I use 3D flowers, leaves and other elements. You can find a lot of elements on our YouTube channel. For work, you need a ball of yarn, mat, cotton yarns, pattern on the paper, crochet hook, scissors, pins and beads. Make a picture in real size and pin it on a mat. Let's begin the work. As you can see, I have already pinned my branch. We are working on the front side. I begin from this part. Now I pin the flower. Pin the cord. I pin the end of the cord. Like this. I pin the cord. I make it longer. I have already pinned it. Now you should sew all elements together in the places of contiguity. Here, here, here. Then we make trim for this cord and inside it. We have sewn all places of contiguity and make trim inside part of the cord. For this, I take variegated yarn, take a loop, as you can see I did sew this part of the work, insert the hook into the chain space, make single crochet, and make the second single crochet. Then single crochet into the next chain space. Make single crochet into the next stitch. Make the second single crochet into the same chain space. Like this. Make single crochet twice into the each e chain space.
I make more single crochet than I did before. For this I turn the work. make single crochet into the same chain space. In this case I have done three single crochet. Make the fourth one into the same chain space. Five. Continue with the next chain space one. Make two single crochet into the each chain space. Make single crochet two together. Pull through. Then make single crochet into the same chain space twice. So continue working in this way till the end of this row. I have done trim for this part of the cord. In this case I made four or five single crochet into the chain space and in this case I did four single crochet. Let's look at the inside part of the cord. Here I did single crochet two together. The leaf is ready. Now we need to fill in up all three places of the inside part of the leaf. For this make a chain you can begin from any stitch. Insert the hook into the stitch, take the working loop pull it through. One, two, chains and double crochet into the stitch. chain 1, 2, remove the hook, insert the hook into the stitch, take the working loop, pull it through. Make a chain 1, 2, yarn over the hook, Make double crochet into the chain space. Make a chain. One, two. Remove the hook, insert the hook into the chain space, take the working loop, pull it through. Make a chain one, two. Remove the hook, insert the hook into the chain space, take the working loop, pull it through. Make a chain one, two, yarn over the hook, insert the hook into the chain space, make half double crochet. Make a chain, remove the hook, insert the hook into the chain space, take the working loop, pull it through. 
chain of two insert the hook into the chain space make single crochet chain one two remove the pin insert the hook into the chain space take the working loop pull it through chain of three yarn over the hook insert the hook into the chain space make double crochet not finish then double crochet not finish into the next chain space and pull through all loops on the hook chain one two insert the hook into the chain space make single crochet chain one two three remove the hook insert the hook into the chain space take the working loop pull it through chain one two three Insert the hook into the chain space, take the working loop, pull it through. So continue working in this way till the end of the space. I have done the mesh in this part of the leaf. As you can see the corner that is located here. I didn't do the mesh in the corner. I removed some pins. The leaf is ready, so we can continue the work. We continue working. As we did here, I pin at next branch. Then you should sew all places of contiguity. Here, here, here. Now I show you how to make the mesh inside part of the second leaf. For this I turn the work. I have made the mesh, but we still need to continue. Let's continue. One. Two, I change my hook to the thinner one, yarn over the hook, insert the hook into the stitch, make double crochet, yarn over the hook, make some strings, one, two then yarn over pull through all loops on the hook make a chain one two three it's enough pull up the working loop remove the hook insert the hook into the chain space take the working loop pull it through Make a chain one, two, three. Yarn over the hook and make double crochet into the chain space. Make two strings, yarn over, insert the hook around the stitch, pull up a loop, one, two, then yarn over, pull through all loops on the hook. Chain one, two.
three, four. Remove the hook, insert the hook into the chain space, take the working loop, pull it through. Chain one, two, three. Pull up the working loop, remove the hook, take the working loop, pull it through. Make a chain one, two. Remove the hook, insert the hook into the cord, take the working loop, pull it through. Chain one, two. Yarn over the hook, insert the hook into the stitch. Make double crochet, not finish. Yarn over, insert the hook into the next chain space. Make double crochet, not finish. Then pull through all loops on the hook. Chain one, two. Remove the hook. Insert the hook into the stitch, take the working loop, pull it through. Chain one, two, three. It's enough. Yarn over the hook, insert the hook into the chain space. And make double crochet. Turn the work. Make two strings, yarn over the hook, insert the hook around the stitch, pull up a loop one, two, yarn over, pull up through all loops on the hook, make a chain, remove the hook, insert the hook into the cord, take the working loop, pull up through, make a chain one, two, Three. Remove the hook, insert the hook into the cord, take the working loop, pull it through. Chain one, two. Yarn over the hook and make double crochet into this chain space. make double crochet into the next chain space. Make two strings, one, and two, then yarn over, pull through all loops on the hook, chain one, two, Three. Insert the hook into the chain space, make single crochet, one, two, insert the hook into the cord, make single crochet. So continue working in this way till the end of the space. I have already filled it up our leaf. Now we need to make a trim for this leaf. Let's begin the trim. I take pink color of yarn, insert the hook into this stitch, take the working yarn, pull it through. Make a chain, then single crochet into the each stitch of the cord.
So continue working this way till this point. As you can see, I have done single crochet till the point. Now we continue the work. Chain of two. Now I show you how to make round element. Yarn over the hook. Insert the hook. Make half double crochet. Two half double crochet. The second half double crochet. Three. Four. And five. Turn the work. Insert the hook into the first half double crochet. Take the work and yarn, pull it through. Here what we have. Make a chain one, two. I will work in this direction. I will work with double crochet stitches. Yarn over the hook, insert the hook into the chain space. Make double crochet. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. We have done five double crochet, two on the work. Insert the hook into the first double crochet. Take the working yarn, pull it through. Here what we have. Chain of two. Yarn over the hook. In this case, I'm going to work with treble crochet. Yarn over the hook twice. And make treble crochet into the next chain space. One, two, three, four, and five. We have done five treble crochet stitches. Two rounds of work. Insert the hook into the first stitch. Take the working yarn, pull it through. By working with the slip stitch. I lost my loop. Let's repeat again. Two hours of work. Here what we have. Now I will work with smaller stitches. Chain of two. Make double crochet five times into the next chain space.
one two three four five two hours of work insert the hook into the fair stitch take the working yarn pull it through two rounds of work chain one two work with half double crochet make five half double crochet to the next chain space Make first one, one, two, three, four. And five turns of work. Insert the hook into the first stitch. Take the working yarn, pull it through. Turns of work. Chain of two. Three. Make single crochet into the each stitch or each chain space. This is the last one. I cut off the yarn. You should remove this yarn to the back side. We have done the dream. Then you should make the dream in this part of the leaf. We'll continue working on this project in the second part of this video tutorial. Thanks for watching.